Good afternoon. This is HR Prime, and with my co-host Cannon Fodder. They call me. Yep. And we are here to cast the SSU uh, Overwatch uh, Junior Varsity match versus what was it? The USD Coyotes. I don't yeah. think that's a kind of beef, but we can assume it is. Oh, a kind of beef. USD is how they grade beef. Is it they grade beef that way? Yes. Okay. USD grades beef. Well, then we'll, we'll grade the beef, and we'll see how this beef last in the match something like that you threw me off with that in no. comparison we're getting the lobby set up and uh as as they get up there what do you expect from uh today's match well since today is the first match we are seeing of a jv roster for overwatch in two three years i expect a bit of shakiness to be honest but shaking out the start but i expect you know some good hearty gameplay to come through i know these guys have been trained under us the varsity They've been trained on their own. They've been putting a lot of work in. So we're hoping for a good fight. And we're hoping to always, as always, play out the win. Fantastic. Well, I hope, hopefully so. I think that, that if they if they show all the, the stuff that they've been, they, all the promise that they've been doing over these past few weeks, and they can definitely pull out a win from here. A lot of, or all of these, these players are, are committed, and they, they, they want nothing more than to, to go far. A lot of them are younger players. That is something fair to note. They are mostly freshmen. This is a freshman. I think there's one or two sophomores there. Yes. But most of these are, you know, people. They're new to the community. Some of them are, some of them aren't. But they're new to the idea of playing competitively. Some of them are kind of shaky. Uh, some of them aren't. If any of you are viewers of what we have of our last week Mid South game for varsity, uh, you will notice there is a repeating player here. Uh, Kilo Destiny will be playing JV. Technically, she is JV player. We have her on varsity for. Uh, you know, backup reasons. And so we're looking to see a lot out of her because she's played with us as varsity. She knows what she's doing. So we're hoping to see a big, a big push out of it. You know, that's, that's our main person we're looking for to kind of lead, kind of be the per the presence that you need uh, to clutch these games out, especially when it's uh, uh, most of these players first competitive experience ever. And we're going into game. Yeah. And no matter what, they have a lot of promise going in into, into this. So here we go. We're going to start. The first map here is Li Zhang Tower. We're going to see what exactly they're going to be, going to be running here today. I don't know how to. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know that. Uh, it is Li Zhang Gardens. Now, there are two ways these maps are usually played. Usually they're played with SimTPs. And you play Rai and Zara. You play close comps that want to fight on point and just hold it. And people can't walk in. You can play more spread comps where they want to go around the point, tickle, dance, do damage, and then commit on a kill lethality-wise. I would. I'm really curious to see what they're what they're going to want to play here. It is looking like they are taking a page from Varsity and wanting to run what 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 my what one of our players is so has uh, so duly called a six man, which you know, okay, uh, but it's like it's like they're, they're opting more for the poke. Play style, not the TP. Uh, I like to see how this goes out. I really would. I want to see how they uh, how they execute this because this is a big execution comp. 
And out they go. And now we're going to see. They're going to be going up, up against uh, a similar, actually not a very similar comp. Looks like that uh, UMD. USD. USD makes it to the point. Makes it to the point Ooh. first. And here we see Monkey jumping in. Jumping in. USD has a control over the point right now. And stuff. They're seeing the SSU trying to get in. Diva Mac goes out. Out of the play, Winston is tickling it, but we lost Kylo Destiny and the mech from BB is Scream. But we Smitty has taken out the Hanzo, Hanzo player. And as they continue to get in here, Lucio almost takes gets out, and he gets taken out by I Am Fred. Looking like they're gonna have to have to back up just a little bit so they can make sure that they can recontest here. And for the mayor, that is a super good disengage there. They realize they're down, realize they can't fight, so they just leave. They're not wasting anything. They're not giving anything. A super clean disengage. A super good knowing when to leave. And they're sending it back up, and it seems like they're all here and ready to go. And it looks like the Winston engages first, goes in to set the set the player straight. And look at that! All the demons out of Mac. Both demons out of Mac, and the ball casts his his uh his minds. And multiple ultimates come out from USD. Tech visor there is kind of unnecessary, uh, I, in my opinion. But they do clean up the fight eventually. USD does just kind of take the picks, take one by one. Deaths instead of giving over. Super, super good play. Super good knowing when to die. Um, but coming into this though, they've SSU should be looking to burn Cola through Death Blossom and just let the Reaper chunk damage. Of course, walking in, they've got into a Nano and uh, Dragons. So if they're going to take these tight corners like they have been. They are kind of setting themselves up to be ran through by a uh, well-placed dragon. Let's see how it ends up, though. Let's they're, they're thinking about what they want to do, though. They're trying to figure out what exactly to do. It seems Sombra is prepared to do something. They have a few ultimates. They're starting to move in. Here they go. They're going back into the same spot. Taking a little bit of damage at, and the poke whenever they're coming in. They're going to back off a little bit. Let everybody heal up. Here comes the big bomb. Takes out two people. And now they're going to have to try to figure out what they're going to do next. Oh, they burned coal, though. So this is they're wanting to fight hard, but they're not really wanting to move. Super disjointed play. Summer's walking away back though. This could be something big here if they stall enough time. It is 92 the point, so they're gonna have to touch. Oh, here comes Smitty. He's gonna go in. He's gonna be using his, oh. his ultimate. Maybe Smitty he's gonna go, get Smitty go. Go, go, Smitty, get him, get him, get him, get him. Smitty go, Smitty go, Smitty go. Yeah, he's gonna take it out too. Taking out too. Taking out too. And the ball coming around. No, taking out, taking out. Ooh, he's down to a headshot. This is not looking good anymore. Hanzo gets hacked. As even goes out of mech. More people fall, one after another, Ooh. and this seems to be it. Lucio is the last one that's on the point. He is trying to stall it out as long as possible so the SSU can get back, but it seems to no avail. And no bodies end up touching the point. That is super sad. They die with both DPS bolts there. Not what you want to see on an opening map. We've started off same measures, though, so same, same in the same style. So, you know, we're going to see how this goes. We're... You know, sometimes it happens. First game jitters is what we're going to chalk that up to. And we're not over yet. Now we're moving on to Night Market. This is a similar map. Now, with Night Market, you can do kind of the same comp here, right? You can play TP comp, TP to window, or you can do what SSU is looking to want a favor to do and play a blow-up comp, which is where you just uh, blow one person up. Super usable at all levels of play and let's just see if they actually can execute it here let's see what they do they're heading out they're running in a little bit slow on the out und makes it usd makes it to the point first but they start to move to trickle in just a little bit they seemingly a, split a little bit split here but they can still survive this if they get their ground back mm. oh take out one silo down now we lost oh no now we kind of destiny out and happy is gone out of the match and Silo gets re res. We take out, take out. I am Fred, but that Ooh. is said for that fight, and they capture their, and USD captures the point. Now the real question here is, what is this baby gonna do? Baby just gonna do the right thing and throw stuff off the map? There. Yep. We there we go. Good. 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 Really right. disjointed play. You know, we're we're hoping to see a little more. Uh, they're kind of flanking a lot, which is what good here. But you know, we, you know, not a bad engage. It's just. Ryan gives so much point presence whenever you're trying to fight. That like if you're not blowing, if you're not using blow up to the blow one person up, you're kind of. Ooh, mm. that's an early shot taken down. They're gonna have to wait that out a little bit, but they're seemingly mm. just gonna go in anyway. Ooh, they're in. 
They're taking they're taking their chances. They don't take nothing. They're, 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 they're poking, they're poking. Versus oh, getting a low, very he's low. Sleep, he's sleep. He's mm. Mm, they're taking that out. Gino you know, taking a flank off to the side. Let's see what he does. Oh, the mercy is going to take out the mercy. No. But poking from all, multiple sides. What are they going to do with this? They need to get their whole team back together so they can push through this. They've lost another support. They need to pull out and stop feeding damage to them. They do force mouth there, which is not a bad trade for not committing too much. But with Gino here, I'm not. Oh, oh that's a big shatter. Mm. Multiple combo. You hate to see it. Yeah, you, you really hate to see it. I mean, on the one person, but. Schmitty takes it. Oh, and uh, copied the soldier and got looped off. Oh, Schmitty, dude. Oh, man. That, you hate to see that happen. You hate to they see still it. have one more push. They've got a push, and all they're going into is bomb. Now, they did want to go ult for ult in that fight, which is not a bad idea, but they're going to have several coming up here. So, you know, we need to see a good engage from Monkey. Monkey needs to get into their back line, cause some disruption, and then, you know, survive. That's everything. Gina goes in to get an ult. Oh, takes out the Mercy. Just for one. Takes out the Mercy. Uh, any spending shots? No, no. Going, they're going. Oh, ooh, the primal is out. And oh, this but Bap is about to go down. They have to pull it together. The hot pants is taking out one by one, and no, another one down. Frisk on baby scream. Ooh, just gets re gets re gets killed instantly. And that is and that. That's that match. That's map one. You go down O2. Now, what what do you think was the big the big problem there. I think that mostly the big problem was that they were not keeping it together. They wanted to, they really wanted to just keep that together and go in as a team. There were some instances where they would get picked off early, which that happens. Yeah. But they need they need to wait, wait for the for whole team to get back together so that they can push in as one unit. They want to run these dive compositions. They need to go in as one. They need to be killing the one person they're looking for. And that's the big thing is they're they're all over the place. They're really spread, you know. But you know, like like I said, first game juniors. That's what we're going to chalk it up to. We're going we're going to yeah. say, you know, like I said, how, most of these guys have never been on. You know, most of these players have never been on stage. Never been had the you know. The match is not over, and they still did. They still did their best, and they still performed very well together. Although they weren't physically together in the match, <laughs> but they did coordinate. Pretty well together. For a fletchling, for a fletchling team, yes, that was pretty, pretty good for them. It, you know, it's you know, just starting. And then second map, we're going hybrid. We're going to King's Row, or as King's Row, the community dubs it, Scrims Row, because you can never go through a game or a scrim without playing King's Row. Yes, you never can. I don't remember. It was probably something like, like twenty odd eighteen before the last time that I never played Scrim Scrims Row in a. In a, in a setting of Overwatch. It's been a bit. Now, there were there are being changes made. We are swapping out B for the Wii's, which is one of our, you know, more, uh, not o- older sounds to me. It's she, season. Season's the word I'm looking for. Season? Season as in she's been around the scene. She kind of knows what she's doing. She's been here for a year or two. She's been kind of watching what we're doing. So, she, you know, she's been with it. Right. So maybe we see a bit more of a step up you know, from that position in this next map. You know, maybe we see maybe we see that off tank kind of, you know, make some plays, you know, want to do something. Because she knows she knows she's doing. Yeah. She wanna see wanna, we'll see what's see what what the Wheeze has to has to say. I mean wheezing her way onto the field. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm revoking your comedy card after this. <laughs> uh, but you can't revoke something I don't have. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, another note on that last match, uh, Z Smitty, or as, or as we have dubbed him, Schmitty, <laughs> um, because Z's and S's are hard back to back. Us Americans did a really good job there of like actually killing things. You know, it's a big step up. You know, Schmitty is one of the, uh, if you're judging by rank, he's one of the more higher rank players. But, you know, rank doesn't matter when we're playing this kind of scene. Mm-hmm. It's just about how your how your team works. Because uh, you got to remember, Hayden's high, I mean, uh, HR here is a higher rank than me, and I'm still a better player. So, you know, it's one of those things where it doesn't really matter when it comes to, you know, competitive integrity. Oh, there you dox me. <laughs> <laughs> we have Wolf 
swamp. swamp? I get. I suppose we're gonna doing some more swamps. So whatever composition that looks oh, like. Oh, the oh, swamping side. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They want to be on defense. So USD is gonna be tanking on the defense, while SSU will be on the attack. Now, usually you want defense first when you're playing these these kind of maps. Defense allows you to set pace. Defense allows you mm -hmm. to like know where you have to go. If you're attacking, your goal is to finish the map. Right. If you're uh, the first, your first attack through. If you're defending and you start to attack your second round, your goal is just to make it to where they make it. And it seems that USD knows that, and they're going to take advantage of their of that opportunity. Because the winning team does get a uh, side pick, mm -hmm. how it's always been. And let's see how they want to play this map. Now, again, the way the, these maps will play out, this map is a fairly straightforward how they're going to play it, right? They're going to want to play. Ryan or Zarya or Ryan or Diva, and then just run at each other, uh, and then just beat, beat each other until someone dies. That is how most King's Rows are played. I don't expect anything too wild to come out of this one, so we will see. We will see uh, what comes out of it. Let's see what opens up here. It is a typical uh, beatdown comp, as I have dubbed it, coming from SSU in the red this time. Now, the interesting thing here, right, mm -hmm. is Diva over Zarya. Most times you want to play Zarya here because Zarya brings more beat power. Zarya does a bunch, a, a buttload more damage, and it, and she scales better. Like scaling is not the word I mean here, but scaling is in. She's in the fight. She does damage, right? Right. She stops CC. She stops this. Diva essentially tells your opponent, "Hey, we know you're going to want to spam us, and we're going to stop you from spamming." That's a great read on their part. Because they do have the junk rat, they do have the soldier, which means their job, their goal here is to spam the shield and just run at it. And off they go. They're going to be taking off that. They're going to be pulling, pulling the gun. They're going to be falling in the wall onto the left. They're going to be rushing in, seemingly. They're not going to pay attention Ooh, the to the junk rat trap. Oh, I don't know. That's, Ooh. you just you hate to see it. And then they're going to commit to the rush because they're already in. Yeah, they're going in. Ooh. They're committing. They should have moved out, but no, no, they're not. They're in. staying in. Goes down. They're just trying to survive. But, but they take up. So the one gets taken out. I'm getting confused on who's on which side. <laughs> they changed the colors up on me. It doesn't matter. Blues Ryan walks in and just starts swinging. We Both. just hit, just just run into them and die. Here's the thing on this map, the divas can't just jump off in. There's no more place to jump off. They have to go back in and swap. Let's talk to a hog and pop down the tank. But if she doesn't, they're losing a lot of pressure here by not having a mech. And what are they going to switch to? They're probably maybe oh, Azaria. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, wait. Uh, yeah, that's Diva? what you have to do here. Oh, you got to oh, go all the way back. You know, you can't die. You have to keep, you want mech, because without mech, you're essentially a third of a champion. It's not even half. It has to be generous for baby. And here they go. They're going back in into the oh. fray. They're going around to the side, looking to get some freezes off. They're holding inside of the theater, into the hotel, I mean. Looking again. Ooh. Oh, the one may gets destroyed. Take it oh. out. Big shatter fight, oh. USD. And that is. And that seems to be it for them right now. They, you know, they super they, they super were not ready for that shatter. That shatter just came in and dropped all of them. You know, one of those things you got you kind of got to be looking for. And then you know, May is such a hardy person in this comp. You need her to not die instantly, as we saw. And make matters worse, SSU is walking into a four ulti team. Both supports, a DPS, and bomb. Let's see how, let's see how they'll handle it. I'm not sure. Here they come. They're coming around. What are they going to do? We's about to oh, lose her mech. Already. Take a damage. But more damage. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Nice walk out. Nobody takes, gets taken out. But the tire takes out one. Ryan takes out the second. Mm -hmm. And now they're just having a fight right here. They're going to have to move back. They've got to leave here. Schmitty gets taken out, too. They've got to leave here. He has to not die. Ooh, he barely survives that one. Three health and a dream. They still have a minute, 25 seconds. They can still make this work. Now, in competitive, that's about two good fights, which means they have to win one of these next two fights. And the only, I mean, they're walking in with pretty good. Ult. Both DPS ult. And they're very close to Ryan as well. Yes, Ryan, uh, Shatter into High Noon, they, Nails and anything. They're looking like they're going to go up high. Probably going to do a high. 
high noon and see what they can do with this. Ooh, they're going to pull it from way high. See what's going to happen about it. Watch him pull it. Oh, they're, oh, they're, they're already backing up. They're already, ooh. Oh, the, the main goes a little bit short, but that's okay. They're going to use that to get the there, get the space. And look at that. Many things. Pull that thing. Pull, 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 pull it, pull, pull it. Pull, pull, pull. Let's go. Ah. Oh, now they're going in. They're going to... Go, Taking go, advantage go, of the go, news! Go. Happy takes down three! Now hey. Silo gets taken out by Smitty! And now the Rusty gets a red one Silo! But Silo is not gonna stay up for long because Smitty is there and Happy is there, making sure that no one is sad. Now, that may up with a zoning note, you can't tell me otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> it might have not been in the proper place, but it surely didn't kept them from running up. Oh, and we actually got the point with that. That's and nice. that's absolutely that's fantastic. Which gives us time to walk into second. Now. Oh, they're going to be taking a taking a little route off to the Ooh. side. Oh, they're going a little sneaky here. They're all crouching. Oh, they're they're getting protect. ready to go. What are they going to use? They have two ultimates Steve in. Can't, Steve can't crouch. They have so many different ultimates. Steve, can't crouch Steve doesn't crouch. Here. She's going to give him away. Oh, no, walk, but that's okay. They got to the point before oh. they needed to. Oh. I don't know. They're kind of indecisive. Ooh. Reinhardt gets destroyed for the chunk rat. And that's what is it? They, they have to leave now. They have to. They have to leave. They could have had that opportunity. They should have just had that the diva learn how to crouch. Diva should, she, diva, diva should be riding cart. Diva definitely should have been the one riding cart. Yeah, diva, yeah diva should have been riding that cart. They're going to try for it again, perhaps. Maybe less sneaky this time. There is a bomb. There is a bomb. They're going a little bit sneaky. But Diva is going to it. Diva can't crouch. Oh, what are they going to do? Oh, Diva has finally got, come to the senses. They're going around. Use that bomb. It's going to go out perhaps soon. Look, throw it throw it, and then let Ryan pin. Oh, oh, they're going for a long end. They're going so for a long. That Diva is behind. Here oh, comes the bomb. Fast, Here comes fast, the bomb. Fast, it's fast. huge. It takes out two. Run, run, run. Get on them. Run them. And now the, the mercy gets in. Now they just have to run them over and tap the point. Soon, Weiss goes over the top. Uh, nice, nice. And as the other, the enemy has to run away. Chocolate gets taken out very late into the fight. Ooh. High Noon comes out a little bit late. Oh, they speed boost. They got a speed boost. They got a speed oh, boost. Boy. Oh, hey. they take out the Diva. Now they're gonna be down one. They might not be able to have a good contest. Oh, but they but, res. But they did res. They'll have mechs. They will have mechs. They don't have any ultimates. Happy might be coming close to his ultimate. Ooh, Flashbang. He has, he has shatter. He has shatter. He has shatter. He took him. Took him out. Silo gets taken out by Happy and oh, a demon. Run it, run it. Oh, oh no, they're, but they're behind them. Okay, okay. This looks bad. But to be fair, they made them use a lot of ult to hold a point that is like point one away, right? So the play here is to leave. Okay, now this is not the play. No. The play here is to just regroup. Because you've got Shatter, Mail, which are super good at, tell, at saying, I want this space, this space. Mine. Oh, and Kylo take, gets destroyed up mm. to the side. But the res, the one problem with the res. Oh, and they mail to the back. He has Shatter, he has Shatter, he has Shatter. Shatter. Oh, he's dead. Oh, this Who is alive? Good. Oh, oh only they... Kylo's alive. Mm. Mm. Kylo died early, couldn't lamp. Well, they still got it pretty far. That, that, is, that is not a bad take. No, that's not bad at all. They just needed a little bit more, a little point, more time. 0.01 meters. You hate to see it. I think whatever, whatever they did, into rushing into them, they kind of just scrambled around and they panicked a little bit, which is understandable. Yeah, yeah. You can always shot. I mean, I mean, I'm gonna keep saying it again. Chalk, chalk it up to first game for first day jitters at this point. But like, like I said, we we said at the first match, you know, it was kind of looking rough. But here, they, they, they look like they know what they're doing. They they, they know what they want to do. They, they know they know how to do it. Which is a good start. It's always a good start for any team, just to know what you want to do and then do it. The real question is, how are they going to defend this? We'll have to see. Looking like they're going to do May Cree. A staple, really. But into Hanzo Soldier, you know, I don't think he was the sauce here. I think Sigma's the sauce. Sigma's the sauce? I think you play Sigma here. Sigma's the sauce. Just because okay. they have an Ana. Tell me why the sauce is Sigma. Ana. Sigma Shield makes Ana healing irrelevant. Oh, well. Mm. So this is why the Sig is the sauce? He's the Sig sauce? 
Sig was the sauce. He was the sauce. Until Lucy came to the fact. Now he's now he's the sauce. I'm getting lost in the sauce. I'm looking I, I'm lost here. in the sauce too. Let's Good. let's let's move, let's move on from the sauce. <laughs> We're gonna go on and here we go. Next round starts up. And we have SSU on defense. Not yes, yes on defense. Yes, yeah. I'm getting my colors mixed up. Oh, they're running it oh, fast. They're oh, running it oh, fast. Oh. What are they gonna do? They're swinging. They're keeping the right alive. Mm. Pappy gets taken out. Obama gets taken out. Mm, but the, the, the but US USD takes it. Loses their line. The thing is getting. This they're is starting turned, to clean up a little bit. It's turned into a brawl like you've never it's, seen it's, before. It is very much, very much chaos. Chaos inducing. Oh, we get taken out of our mech. We still have Gino HD. Oh, Gino, do it. Oh, gotta take up a little more. Mm. Mm. Gino got turned down to 1080p. <laughs> but Ryan came. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and uh, that would be US, US, USD. A little overstaying their welcome from the Reinhardt, you know, limit testing kind of. But here's the, here's the real thing. They are so far up. Are they going to get respawns and just have this staggered out the entire way? That's the big concern. You don't want Oh, they do. take out the Rhine. They push up way too far. They can use this. Use this immensely. Happy is very close to shatter. They they have nothing them. to block it. Oh, yeah, no. Oh, oh, oh but that, it's that's that's smart. That's oh, that's theirs. That's, that's theirs. theirs. Go around and use it. Fire strike. Fire strike through that thing. Take out five or six of them at once. Ooh. Oh, that's oh they right. use dragons. Ooh. Oh, wait, yo. They're amazing. They're, they're amazing. They're amazing. Use the shatter. Oh, oh, it gets blocked by their own. Oh. By their own. But they're still going to go through. Swing, swing, swing. They're going to keep swinging. Swing through your life, sweet crap. Oh, no. And they all get taken out. But they were close enough. They will have another free contest. Yeah. Sure. You know, as a rhyme player, watching your own may just throw a wall in front of your shatter hurts my soul. Hurts. It, it's happened me a couple times. And it just, it, it. It makes you reevaluate life. It's a, it's a wee bit of a miscommunication there, but it happened to the best of us. Yeah. And here they're coming back. US UMD, USD, whatever, USB, whatever their 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 bloody name is. They're coming back, and nobody gets taken out by that bomb. That Ryan is super far in. Oh, but do they touch? Is the real question. Can they touch? They gotta touch. They gotta touch. They gotta get in and touch. They have ulties. They, they have, have ulties. ulties. They gotta use the ulties. Go in. Come on, oh, SSU, go. let's go. Here comes the high noon. High noon. Deems the remake. The demon gets the remake with the bomb and the remake. Kill as well. Get that Ryan out of here. Is, Smack him in is, the face. Is there enough staying power with just the Ryan? Just to oh, win? no. Just a, they have Ryan either. That's just enough staying power just to just to win. And mm. SSU. USD wins. And SSU USD. Uh, drops it. I mean, I mean, that was good. No, that was a, definitely a good... And oh, but right. happy gets gets the play of the game. Let's see, let's, 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 let's watch this. Let's see this absolutely mental play. Ooh. Three go down, doesn't use the window, but you know, respectable, and just walks out. I mean that that right there is what I deserve MVP of every game we ever play. That that that's what I look well, like. Well, of course you would say that because you're the one that's playing it. I mean, yes, you have a point. I do have a point, and I I'm usually, usually do. Right. Sometimes. <laughs> I can I can grant you that sometimes. <laughs> now the real question is, what are they gonna? Oh, is this a best of three? Look like at the best of five because they're going it's to the best of five. Best of five. Okay, they're still gonna be going. They're gonna be going to Pavana. Now, the real question is, well, let's see. Who are they swapping? Funny is coming in for Gino, and it looks ooh, oh, swapping sides. I bet you maybe. No, Beeb's back in. They're probably gonna figure out the composition and then swap. Swap them. You gotta remember, there are a lot of JV players here because they have a big pool to pull from. Cabbage and Terran. Okay, Cabbage and Badger. New names, we haven't seen them yet. This yet this set. So I see where they can go. Um, but looking at Havana, it makes it makes me think. Are they gonna try what we tried? Are they gonna try a spawn hole of Havana? Perhaps. Well, that's gonna be that's gonna be dependent on. I wonder what they're gonna get first. I mean, like I said, most maps you're, you're going to play. If you if you have the choice, you play defense first, so you can set tempo a lot easier. Yes, but the SSU doesn't have that pick. So if they get stuck with attack, and they don't go, and they, they end up going very far. 
if they are going to run it on defense, they will know how to. They should know how to fight, fight against it. They should. They should. They've seen us do it, and they've they've seen the Bears talk about it. So we're gonna see how this ends up playing out. But you know, funny is a new is a first time we're seeing him this year and this set. Uh, and so and same thing with Cabbage and uh, Taron Badger. I know they are really good players. I've played with them a couple times. Uh, definitely, definitely good for what they're doing, especially at their level. Their levels are not very indicative of how they're going to play. That's the, that's the thing with this team, right? If you look at, you know, take that first match. Z Smitty, or Smitty, level level 46, right? Okay. Level 46. He is, he is killing everything. He is just, he is the damage dude. Right? And so... I'm excited to see him just kill things. I'm hoping for a double sniper somewhat, so he can just pop heads, let him do his thing, let him figure out how he's going to want to do it. Right. That, that's the big <clears throat> thing, right? Is I want to see, you know, we're here for the JV, but remember, we're also looking, you know, we, we want to culture the players that can take the spots of varsity players whenever, whenever you know, we inevitably graduate or like Hayden drop out. Um, that's not true. Hey, uh, you want to tell me more about your physics class? I love physics. Physics is hard. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> all in good fun. Um, but yeah, we uh, so we're, we're hoping to cultivate some players that you know know what they're doing when they, when they step on when they step on the varsity, as I as I call it, you know, my line. You know, it's not a very nice way to put it, but whenever they, whenever they become players that I have to coach, uh, not coach, but lead. Words are hard sometimes. Um, it's okay. You'll get them one day. We can only hope. Yeah. Uh, well, I hear that you're going to be taking a class with us soon. Oh, God. English 101? I, I think the pre-K locked me out of the school mm, last time. That's unfortunate. Yeah, I, I, I failed coloring 202. That was a big hit to my, my GPA. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I uh, kind of saw that one coming. Apparently red isn't the same thing as blue. Who could have told me? Yeah. Anyway. I... Want to think they're probably you know teams are sitting down they're, they're talking over what they want to do, how, they, how they want to play the map that's a big thing here right Havana points are innately lead to three different major styles of play you've got point A of Havana who wants to play super long range and DPS folks and they're hitting heads and they're doing damage point B wants to play more of a you know fight the tight corners and the chokes and the doing damage in burst and then point c is just considered the if there's no sniper you lose the fight point c is kind of the hardest one to be fair i don't expect i don't expect either of these teams to finish this map this map is known to be super like demanding on the players because it's just it requires just an attunity to understand the flow of how the maps are going to play. Because this is like this one of the most all over the map maps there is in the game at this point. So I want to see how they decide to fight this. We're still waiting for them. They might be doing some be on a uh, maybe five minutes, perhaps. Uh, soon. So we're waiting to see what they're planning to do. Um, they're probably taking a little, a few moments to recuperate and talk it out and figure it out. Oh, but here we go. We're, we're going. Not, we're not. We're not, we're not. That's fair enough. Yeah, forget what I wanted, what, I, what I'm speculating to be. And here we go on a beautiful Havana in Cuba, I believe. Am I wrong? I don't know. There was a song about it. So, I mean, that's the only reason we ever know what it is. Like Emilio Cabello, it was called Havana. It was like top of the charts in like 2019. Careful, you might get a copyright claim. Oh. Yeah, fair enough. Let's see what the, let's see what these teams want to open up on, though. That's the real predicament here. Is what are they going to want to open up on? Mm. That's like the same style of just rush. Yeah, it does. Well, they're attacking first, right? Yeah, yeah. So the, the, the other team takes defense, take first, as you would from any given standpoint. 
and they're gonna play traditional double shield, hold them back, poke them down, do damage. Are they gonna do a spawn hold? It doesn't seem to be. So SSU doesn't have to worry about people. Well, they're moving up a little bit. They're moving, but they're not. I don't, I don't know. They're per not committing. Perhaps. Well, I, I don't think so. I think they're kind of holding here. They're holding the typical forward hold corner. Which yes, is they're, hold, they're holding the comp corner. This is the comp corner. This is the corner you always hold in comp. Yeah. You don't you get flames. Yeah, yeah. All right, but that gives us plenty of room here on, on JV to, to just decide where to go. I'm playing die with the reaper sombra and the typical supports that you play in in dive now yeah. they're just gonna have to decide where they're gonna go going on the inside Ooh. with a long dive like that in not store. the best idea but they probably have a plan in store getting ready to go sombra's already off to the side drawing their attention a little bit let's see if i can get over to to that one yeah. definitely pulling in a lot of damage Ooh. and oh no no oh, gets out just in the nick of time but Cabbage Brian, it gets taken out. When he does get out. Now the thing here is like Diva needs to be eating these homes. Like that is the that is the one win condition of this team. Mm, it's unfortunate he can't do that right now because Diva lost her mech and Schmini lost his life. And so did the mm. Diva lost her life as well. Oh no, this no, this is this is where it gets scary because the Diva into this comp, Diva needs to be eating all the spam. Diva needs to be eating uh the uh Arista Hall needs to be eating BAP healing when he's chunk when he's chunking healing into the players. So mm. like this is on the diva to, to really get this clear through these chokes. Lost to Rain Badger before the fight even began. Mm. I can't be having that. That was the only person with the ultimate in there. I don't, know, I don't know what Sombra. Sombra's preparing to get get something in, putting that in a translocator, looking to go and try to poke him out. By the time that the Arisha gets back, Dragons, Dragons come out. comes out into there. Ooh. Ah, and Happy oh, gets stuck oh. in the corner and gets destroyed by a BB of Scream, loses her mech. Yeah, you hate, you hate to be caught, as any man can, you hate to be caught in a corner and just watch your health slowly tick away by the by the very edge of Dragon. And box. UMD starts to clean them up. The way to get, to get another push out here in a moment. Now they're going into a supercharger and a valve. Now, the cool thing about Valk is Valk can also be used for damage boosting. So they're looking at a 85% damage increase, roughly, if they pop both things at the same time. But the Oh, they're motor... going. They're going in. What they're happy it's going mental. I'm going into the circuit to the soldier. Soldier gets taken out. That's another one. Taken out. Schmini gets taken out. Happy gets taken out. What are they gonna do now? I am afraid gets res. The only two kills that they got in that fight. Ah, uh, but you want to be gotta be cleaning that up. It was a good push. It was a good push. They got that card up. And they had the right idea. And Terran Badger survives on a very, very little bit of health. Skates it away. Now, coming into this, Funny has EMP. EMP is a massive game winner if it can get off. The problem is you're going into four defensive ults. You're coming into Window, coming into Dragons, Tac Visor. Oh, this is a huge away. opportunity to get that EMP off. Let's see what they do. Uh, EMP is going out now! Fine. And they're coming in! They're coming in! They're having no more ult! That's all of them that are locked into they that EMP! Win. They have to win this! They have to take something out! They gotta take it out! Dragons come comes through! And PB of Scream loses their life! Mm. And it's a happy loses his life too! Smitty gets taken too! Smitty! Smitty go! Smitty go! Smitty go! Smitty go! go. He's doing his go, ultimate! Go, go, he takes out three! Go, go. No! He Come gets taken away! But Funny go! Funny! Victory Point 11 is taken up! Hey! Clean it up in it! And they all clean it up the fight! And Smitty is doing just Smitty things at this point, man. He's absolutely Smitty! Smitty is doing just Smitty things. He's killing everything. But he's what we said, one of the major players of this comp. And because of Smitty, they made sure to get that point captured. They capped this point. They they're allowed to fight another day. That's the big point here. They're allowed to fight another day. An absolute another day. And let's see what they do for this another day. BB Scream, scream already loses her mech. Ooh. Happy Ooh. goes in and gets some rock middle. Oh. Middle flight. Yeah, it's yeah, destroyed. Yeah. Yeah, see, just rocks in the middle of jumps. And jump arcs are so predictable sometimes. They are pushing cart through this choke, though, which, which means they'll have a good position to fight from. Just the Lucio. Well, Lucio's kept losing his might lose his life here. Oh, gets rocked by the Hanzo. 
Now we're going to have to wait. Research. We're going to wait up. Bumper is looking, doing some scouting. This is absolutely what you want to do as, as a Sombra. You want to make sure where you get that information. Terran Badger loses their life as well to a random Hanzo arrow. And we know they're that Hanzo. The two by fours that are coming down the down the choke. That let's, can be terrible. Let's be honest. Hanzo doesn't shoot two by fours. Hanzo shoots the entire tree. Yes, that's that's true. I have seen Hanzo arrow. And funny, he's not, not sure what to do. Oh, he, oh he loses his life. Overstays his welcome. Overstays his welcome. I'm not even sure that he had it. Well, Smithy's Smitty, going in. Smitty, Smitty gets taken out though. The super, super all over the place fight. Maybe a stream. The question is, what are they going to do with Happy Falls too? Which is oh, and the net goes, the down. Net goes down as they well. Just point here. Like they, 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 they just got to take like clean. Yep, they're going to have to get cleaned up, die as fast quickly as possible. Yep, and you, you M U S D, with the. I'm starting a jar. Every time, every time you get a team's name wrong, <laughs> I want a dollar in that jar. Well, it's not my fault. They're very buying, close to USB. I I am buying dinner with after every stream we do, with that jar full of wrong name money. Am I going to be invited? No. Okay. Because you're the one that messed up the name. I'm All sorry. right, but they're going back in. Happy has his ultimate. Oh, he's looking for he's it. He's looking for it. He's Ooh. going in. He's using his ultimate. A little, bit, a little bit early. Get him in the to a corner. He's definitely dislodging oh, them, oh. keeping them alive. He's just yeah. choosing to go over there. But Smitty takes out one. He's going after Smitty. another. Smitty's going to take out. He's teleporting oh. over. Ooh. He's going after the Marissa. Marissa's oh. taking out. Oh, Smitty. Smitty's Smitty taking Smitty out Smitty. three. Smitty just taking out things and doing Smitty things. Oh, man. Smitty things actually may just open up this. Just may just crack this wide open. They crack it wide open like an egg. The real question is, can I get a retouch here? Mercy no, they absolutely capitalized on the Mercy being overextended. Now, the thing is, are they going to fight here? Is Smitty going to... Oh, oh, they're going to oh. get the dragon. What are they going to... What's he going to do? Down one. This fight's pretty Smitty easy. uses his ultimate, and he takes out two people. Three That's people. That should be that should be point C. Point yeah, B. point point B. Point B. Taking out Smitty. Takes out Ooh. one. Now he's going to get Mercy. Mercy. Get that Good. juicy Mercy. There we go. Absolutely now. fantastic. Here's where we have to call in the comp. Now, here's, here's where we have to call in the question SSU's comp, right? Mm -hmm. Because this is known as the sniper point. SSU has been notably not a fan of snipers. So, do they keep with what they know, or do they try to play the sniper in the sniper matchup here? That's the real thing we have to look at. They are holding aggressively, though, for not to not mess with the snipers. So, this may be their one best opportunity. Diva gets hacked. Ryan goes down. They use their, their Diva. Oh, hey, Ryan gets destroyed. Bombs the bomb's going, going out. Bomb's oh, coming out. Big bomb. Big, big bomb. Taking out two. Smitty going in. Going to take out. Smitty's looking for kills. Looking for kills. Smitty's, Look at Smitty doing Smitty things. Smitty needs that. Smitty needs that. Needs that uh, KD pad. Yeah, he needs that. Oh, Ooh. the Smitty gets taken out. It gets destroyed. Ooh, he gets blindsided by a random arrow. On the shooting those two by fours. Those big old tree trunks. Oh, but Happy's a little bit out. Ooh, happy a little bit too. Out. Happy for his own good. Mm. Oh, oh, but he splits the, the shatter. shatter. Oh, the dragons out? The dragons comes out. What are they going to do with this? Maybe a scream about to lose her mech. They, Loses they, the mech. They can't fight here. They can't fight here. Smitty they cannot fight. The well, they have to fight here. This is the last bit. Oh. And Ryan gets... Just, just, we kill him. We have lost track of Ryan. Ryan's in the back line. Mm, the was they used. They're trying oh, to use their ultimate. Yeah, they have, they have no, 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 no. They can... They have beat. Oh, but the free mech kill on the right heart. This could be out. it. Give you all that's, that's uh, needed. It's blues beat. Mm. I think that's that. It is that. Bomb. But oh, it gets boobs. Oh, Marissa's more is going to come back and use it. Mm. Mora got canceled out of her ultimate as soon as she used it. A little bit late. I don't know if she had just gotten it or or what. Now, as I did say, we don't expect any team to ever finish Havana. Havana is such a long, drawn-out map at all points of the game. You don't expect anyone to finish them off. But the very fact that they got that far that's, is is absolutely phenomenal. That's a staple right there. That is absolutely phenomenal. That is exactly what you want to see. They saw opportunities and they took it and they got it. They took out that mercy. Smitty saw an opportunity, used his ultimate, and cleared out. He did it twice. I mean, Smitty at this I mean, I mean, it's, it's just Smitty things. I want to mean just just Smitty things, but like team wiping them with Reaper roll is just Smitty things at this point. Like he's just he's doing what he wants to do, he's killing people, he's doing his thing. Yeah, they they definitely want to use 
use uh they're working with emp and all kinds of stuff oh they're gonna be going to play junk rat what are they gonna be doing with this now it's double shield so they, they want staying power junk rat makes sense here uh soldier makes i mean this this, this is a pretty good hold your hold your ground comp uh the problem is Junkrat makes hold your ground hard because Junkrat sends them into your ground pretty easily. Junkrat is a super good displacement tool, but it's, it's as long as I can play with the damage and play with like the TC and how we actually innately works, this may be a good, maybe a solid hold from SSU. They're gonna be playing the comp corner. Well, they don't peak, which is a good, you know, no early shield, nothing, nothing blown. Let's see what they do. They're going to be throwing some spam. Definitely have have the spam. They're going to definitely be the ones that beat in the shield wars. They're going to continually keep spamming out, out their shields. Pulling in that front line. They're oh. crashing head to head. Lamp comes out. A little early. Taking that out. Rock goes out. Holding the corner. Holding that corner. Holding the corner. Happy gets taken out. That's one. Now they're going to take, they're going to seize this opportunity and they're going to run in. Into it. Stray Redwood catch. But he's already got tire. Is he going to use it? Ooh. He's using it already. Ooh. What is he going to do with it? Go. It's going to go. Lamp is up, so he, he doesn't have full lethal yet. Lamp has to go gonna, for this to get. It's going to take out a few. Tire does take up taking the mech, which is massive here. Actually, I think, I think that may have bought them just enough time to that, get their bodies back. They, they might have. I mean, he's going to go. Got to try to get back. Oh, they need to get this back spawn, this guy. They, they got to get. They got to. Yeah, they gotta kill these people. Kill them. You can kill this point. Or else it's, or else they're getting all their ult. Well, they have their ultimates here. They're using their forced to use window. Use this window. And it's being taken out. Taking an eye out, Fred. I am Fred. Excuse me. You, you think it's the real Fred from like 2009? I would hope not. Yeah, I think we all hope not. Well, let's see. They have Sigma Flux, and they have they have they're close to Happy Salt. They almost have Wiz Arista Bongos. They have Visor. Oh, they need oh, that. They, not, I mean, not nice. They need to eat it. They need to get here's, it. They need to get it out of the way of that. He has gold. Here's the, here's here's the, the gold. He used that gold a little late. Take it out. Sigma. They, no, he's going to get shattered. At least he didn't use his ultimate. Junkrat's going to go. He's going to go ham. Doing just Junkrat things? Just doing Junkrat things. Pulling them one. Getting close. Using it. <laughs> going to get taken down. Oh, swing, swing for the fences. Oh, Arista, Arista, uh, this is bad. Brig, Brig's over here. What, what are they, what is he gonna do? Oh, this is bad. Just die, die already, die! Now, coming into this, USD, four old. Defensive, too aggressive. Well, they're gonna, they're gonna burn dragons to force them out here. They already started up to the fight. They should have been waiting. Mm. They didn't wait for the entire team. It, it, to be fair, USD pulled the trigger there first. They, they, they are just trying to get these back spawns online. On, on the upside, SSG's walking in with five old. That absolutely is true. Which means they should, you know, they should be looking for a halt into lift, halt into tire, halt into anything. Halt is a massive setup tool. I want, I want to see a big tire coming out here. I want to see a flux, but they, they lose the bat early. They lose the bat. But it was the only one without the ultimate. They do a flux. Oh no, the happy gets destroyed. Looking like he's going to use his tire here soon. He's thinking, he's thinking. Here he goes. Here's the tire. It's going to go. It's going to get the Lucio. Oh, they're going to take out quite a few. But, it, but Hot Pants is going to take. They got a few as well. Hot Pants has just coined it. Absolutely demolished. The only one there to touch is Bap, but I don't think they're wanting to, to commit that. To be, they should. They should not want to fight this. Oh, uh, but it, 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 oh, there, there goes Arissa. Oh. And that's I, the worst thing that happy. could happen. That is the worst thing that could happen here. Is they lose their bat super early on in the fight. Just because and now they, they gotta they gotta play very defensively. Yeah, they have no they have no front line. They have a Sigma which USG is knows that they that they've lost their main main tank. And Ryan's just walking. Ryan's walking and in. Ryan, Ryan's walking in because he has that free space. What are they gonna what are they they're gonna do? But ever he comes back, they're starting to, to push it back in. Little dragons and big stuck. Uh, big, 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 Q, stuck big, huge, big, huge sigma stuck. Oh, but the, the Hanzo is going to be using that amp wall to just absolutely Ooh. demolish as many gets knocked off the map. I would honestly rather fight against Storm Arrows than I. And I, Cabbage I Brian is underneath the bridge. If Cabbage dies here again, 
on a super back spawn like that is no bueno. Yeah. No, no bueno. That junk right there getting close. Junk is close to tire. Junk, junk is close to tire. You're gonna have you're gonna have to need it. Yep, they have, they have they the need it. They took to take out Spilo. He's gonna take this opportunity to throw it out. There is no there is no wall. There, he takes out two people with the tire. He understood that there was no no lamp to protect them. I mean, yeah. And super, Junkrat gets taken out as well. Super but the rest of the tanks are there to, to clean up the rest. They check out Shadowy Cry, Shadow Cry, and now they're just having to hold this corner right here. Super good read on not being able to actually bath lamp the uh, the tire. Absolutely. But here's the problem. They have probably about 10 meters left to go on this. The enemy team does. They're... I think you've got a hole for their life. We just, we just gotta see Sigma using his ult. Pulling out, pulling out view. Oh no. Run, run, run. Oh, no one gets no one gets destroyed. But no, Happy goes down. Terran Patrick goes down. Schmitty trying to take out some more up close and personal. The only person that's alive still is Junkrat. Yes. He's going in. That's gonna be Doing game. And yeah. That's it. That yeah. They had some solid ult comp combos. And various other things, but in the end, USD pulled it out. Oh, Smitty. But Smitty gets to play the game. Just Smitty things. Just doing Smitty things with his, with his bubble gun and stuff. In, into the back. Into them, into them, taking advantage. Absolutely fantastic. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Just using the ultimate. Ooh. Who's going to stop him now? Ooh, just, just Smitty things there at the end. Just Smitty things. Great showing, though. Like You, you can definitely tell from map to map. They were they were learning what they wanted to do, how they wanted to do it. SSU definitely picked up bit by bit by bit how they wanted to play this and how they, how they, and they read their opponents. That's a super good mark of a good team. We're, we're hoping to see more of them later on. That will be the last game of the set, last game of the night. Thank you all for joining us, and we'll see you all again sometime. This has been Nick. Discover Shawnee State University for yourself. Please visit discover.shawnee.edu.